The ocean is vast. The ocean covers 71% of the Earth's surface and contains 97% of the planet's water. It supports the life of nearly 50% of all species on Earth. The health of these ecosystems is essential to all organisms, especially humans. <laughs> One in every six jobs in the United States is marine related, and over one third of the U.S. gross national product originates in coastal areas. Plastics are versatile, durable, and inexpensive materials that have become an important part of our daily lives. How has the introduction of plastic into the ocean affected the marine ecosystem and organisms within? Sea Education Association has been collecting data on floating plastic debris for more than 25 years through its undergraduate program. In October 2012, 38 scientists, sailors, and students will embark upon an SEA expedition from San Diego to Honolulu to uncover the effects of plastic debris on the ocean ecosystem. So, uh, get as quickly as we can. A widespread misconception is that the North Pacific is home to a floating landfill of trash that stretches as far as the eye can see. In fact, most floating plastic debris is typically smaller than your pinky fingernail and is not easily spotted, even from the deck of a ship. The Plastics at Sea North Pacific Expedition will investigate the community of microorganisms inhabiting the plastic debris, known as the plastosphere. It will determine whether floating plastic provides a means for potentially invasive or pathogenic species to spread to new areas. The vessel will survey for Japanese tsunami debris to understand its path and predict its arrival on the U.S. shorelines. The scientists will also study how wind and currents affect the movement and degradation of polyethylene and polypropylene plastic. There will be a strong web-based outreach component designed to interpret the scientific findings for both K-12 student audiences and the general public. A team of educators will create lesson plans and exhibit materials for aquariums and museums to ensure that the outcomes of the expedition reach far beyond the internet audience. People and plastics are here to stay. This relationship is just beginning to be understood by SEA investigating the effects of plastic in the ocean ecosystems.